uh, a subject in the book, as you can see in the table, both his parents are already deceased, and the two persons under the bioterminalist of his wife and his child. For the family of the man's parents, the last person will jump out of the world and will jump out of the world and by the number of sins as a strict man. Always, always provided for his family and always made sure his family was taken care cared for. Due to this, he was only able to father one child. Don't you see yourself? Byron believed that his father did not want to have another child because of this financial situation, which is this exact capability of facing another child's mention as they were moved back into a daily basis. By his father worked so hard and expected him to be a Consequently, by his father was always in the field, toiling away and moving and his father to be so hard for Byron to talk to his father. But when he applied for a conversation with her, his father simply repeated him to take a number of his class. The only thing that his father can pass to him is a good home and a good education. How does that feel now? Life. <laughs> life. Byron is the chief of Byron to his father. Because... I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know what I'm saying. He, seeing him as somebody only checking up on his results, he initially thought of his father as a slave driver <laughs> with no time for pleasure or relaxation. This would lead Byron to my parents. <laughs> his father during his younger <laughs> years, <laughs> which led him to <laughs> being punished. His father thought that his punishment was usually corporal. Using a leather belt with his new tail area and after the but after though he would be told as to why it was not going to explain the things that were done wrong. This usually happens when I am just laughing in his studies or disobeys orders given to him such as his routine chores of washing in the ships. This happened at least when he was in the same time when he was old, learn and adapt to his father's ways. Byron was not one of his feelings for his father, as he seldom shares other concerns with his father. Byron was only accepting his father's ways, and by the time he entered college, until he graduated, he thought that he completely understood all the actions that his father has done to raise him well, and beyond that, their status was very important. And for this, it was simple. During his later years, Byron's father attended to the farm, and refused to any help from him. Byron was back to his father's wishes, and when his father died due to complications of hypertension in the old age, Byron was about 15 years old. He decided to take over the farm that his father has worked hard on ever since Byron was born. She gave him the only source of information for the family and the court. In that respect, Byron believes that he took his father's principles into heart, and thus, this is the ultimate from his father. Byron's mother was the woman. Byron's father taught him principal. His mother taught him sensitivity, love for art, and appreciating the small things in life, among other things. His mother devoted himself to the care of Byron, making sure that he was tended appropriately. His mother's time is usually divided equally between housework and tending to Byron, and she gave time for him whenever he needs help in his presence, juggling it with housework. She is present most of the time during school, Byron's school activities and making sure that there was no problems, as well as supervising him with chores at home. During their free time, she would take Byron to dance, competitions, or teach him how to play guitar and sing. 
Mary believes that this is the origin, of course, of what he writes, which became the basis of his career as a teacher of art later in his life. He also shared the years of his feelings with his mother, and was closer to her from the beginning, in contrast to his father, and he became closer only to his life. Just a little bit of 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 a little <clears throat> taking another gap of his parent in the same year and he could really go to himself more to, to the art of his past teaching. Like his mother, he offered a the accolade to both his mother and father for him to death of his parents was heartbreaking. The buyer was sure that he would not have wanted him to stop moving forward after they were involved. So he continued to pursue his endeavors. Although it was not easy to pursue that at first, it did not disrupt his activities and instead served as a reason for him to see his life. Till the end of the day. Byron got married at 20 years old with his college sweetheart, and his son followed soon after. Looking back, Byron reflected on the fact that his father might have been the reason that they too decided to have one child. The coincidence is their child was also made. At the early stages of their marriage, Byron was expected to be a dinner and started to work with local chefs. And he passed through the restaurant and retail store before finally landing his career as a teacher. Byron shouldered all the load of being a living for the family and leaving the housework to his wife. He tried to undo his father with Monica was angry that he would be a fantastic father. He knew that he could do some aspect of the reason as to why it was in there. And he describes this approach to parenting was flexible and depends on the situation. Now and then he could have punished his son, but when the basis is in front of his students, Byron would most definitely pull him aside and give him a room to lecture about how important it works in the case. Now, at this point, Byron's son, at this point, the interview Byron's son shared that he prior to his father's home, his father was quite strict to him. But eventually, he and his father slowly began seeing eye to eye as they both grew older. Byron and his wife had the same day in the past experience. They were together to do the best for their child, but it was not perfect. Early on, his wife and his wife and Byron and his wife most of his time were at work and was the one who was in the building which the uh, lectures in part would do certain activities that she felt was very strange about him. But after a lot of talking and adjustments, they were able to be halfway where they established a different plan for their family to just leave the other and talk. We still have their money. I don't know. But none that was big enough. Who, who's your dad? For my dad. My dad describes that if he had the chance <laughs> for the older that he would have changed. Pag-a-nervous breakdown. For the person on search of the street or our own music. My dad is born from G-1-1-0-0-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-1-
He was the majority of his kingdom, the of his rules, the other class, the very little leader and the follower, depending on the job that he was born. But he would say that he would be most of the way. Being the only child, he thought that he was expected to perform. This made him feel that there's something to do. He tries to make his parents proud. Because they were getting all they can for him. During times that he felt short of achieving, he would be offering Tinapon, tinapon na yun. 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 Tinapon, Uh, at this point, he still had some friends during some of the years. Then he got illegal on my birthday. Contest the results. Uh, this, uh, oh, no, it's a team, man. But it's illegal, man. It's illegal. Is that a coin power? Which is the way to do it. Bang activities. 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 I am sure that this has produced the most amazing for him to be able to easily balance the major and the studies by a proprietor of the university 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 of the which led him to so the eye of others who see him and will start to be close to perfect as much as he can. Baron believes that this factor led him to his high school years as he made his progress as above average in class, also in the age of the extra figure of the piece in the mouth of the school. It will make sense when I open shop, as he graduated from the honors in the school. After he had been returned to high school, he immediately championed the fortune to be the champion, to make the team of his family. When his father refused to have a return to college, he would be smart and continue to be diligent in his school. Byron took this to heart, so he took his father to the side of the plan, and not saying that he's called it, which took some of the load off his time to be mentioned. Byron's college years were more challenging, forcing him to devote himself to his time almost exclusively. Byron's college required him to be more rigid in his ways as he started to increase in real level. He wanted to perform as perfectly as he can as his own for the police's college. Thus, was, thus, he was bucking heads with some of his classmates during group works and he preferred to go on solo activities. Instead, of, instead of, with the mindset of, if you do not, if you want to properly, do it yourself. <laughs> But when I realized we have no amount of time to relax, <laughs> such as we pause during summer breaks, he's still able to socialize with friends, which led to him meeting his eventual wife. He was considered the leader and became the president of his class, and also finished his college studies. Going for years, he thought he would win the first year of no hitches and was not the end of the round. Yes! We found out that he was going to buy a round of the final job. I'm sure you can see past the work of our illustration from Open Beans teaching career. During this year, Byron had a small comfort and comfort during this year was the best. My relation to his work that day, Byron was much in shock. A reliable worker would be the one counted on when things are in chaos. It's not to be a philosophy to get the job done, no matter the cost of part of the first time as an employee, here, and the co-workers. He would be a he would be a he would be a he would be a to go out drinking with them, but he only enjoys the company and does not overnight and how to help. But as Byron got in there, 
is not that movie. Decided to ang link kasi, ang, ang tulong kasi na ginapoint out ni Mama Nel is yung exit from the episode. This is how he decided to tackle ang job. And of course, uh, the oil. Which is a layo sa atin. Five hours and days. Days. Oh, okay. Prior to his being a teacher. This is for example, he's going to be a teacher. Kasi dati na ba sa ito ay may ikot? For the coming of his child. Bang ng fire. Nagtulo din talaga man nila. Ang ganda ng mga aspas doon. Wala engage lang guys This also for this also were the early tensions in the marriage. Sige review ko. Bakit ang message ko before working it out with this watch and being able to just later along with the video. Kailangan mag-figure din siya. Eventually after two years of search na pati siya. Diba? Ano ba siya mag-bra na? Kasi ito yung mga 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 It is when the respect of the college and the peer of the students is by us not the youth of the teacher and is forgiven when it comes to achieving results. But despite that, after the day, he is still someone who the students have a true thing to be shared some of their problems with. He described his time as a teacher as something that he could never replace, but he decided to retire early. Age of 55, focus to focus on the commandment. Of their fun, as far as fun, he hesitated. He hesitated to retire early, but wanted to give his father a chance to perform. But his father left him. Eventually, found that the passion in him didn't improve. He continued to help students. And also other groups in arranging musical pieces or dance, which also uses for the extra income. And not to blame the residents. His favorite pastime would be listening to music or watch, watching dance, which he is most thankful for because he got to do that even till his later years. Violins is himself as a minimum. In this, his sexual preference of the office of charity, he was oriented on his sexual preference. He was oriented on his sexual preference ever since. And that was his wife, who bore one child who loves the girl in the third support scene. He was not involved in any form of combat training. How was he associated with any other political political groups? He is a college graduate who is in his room at all, but is not strict in his beliefs and is not for the church. He also has a history of court with conditions, illegal actions, and careers in the history of gambling. Or use of the internet. And for the substance aspect of this, sorry. For the substance so aspect you have of to wonder, theory, even with all those two the two most notable so is just uh, alcohol, which he started at 17 years of age, uh, due to peer pressure. He usually drinks twice a month, approximately two standard drinks, and continue to use it out of the habit. He has stopped and take five years ago. And, then, um, and the second one was his coffee, which also started at 17 years of age, due to curiosity, usually at the once a day, one cup. As a new habit, or if I don't want to see the company, so he had the toughest one day prior to the fire console. And again, there are no illicit substances for the of systems. Knowing how to support uh, them can be hard. <laughs> <laughs> the most it's easy. Uh, yes, Paul? Before we proceed with the ROS and physical examination, are there any clarifications for Okay. 
Wala ka doon na nag-alit ka. Wala na doon tayo. Um, Dave, you have a copy of your protocol? With yes, you. Doc. Can you yes, resend it? Um, uh, I don't know if you can send it on the <laughs> chat, but um, because the the email that you sent, uh, it doesn't have an attachment. Uh, I'm very, I'm very sorry. I'm very sorry. We can do it that that way so that um, we can also it will be easier for any clarifications. Yes, yes. Um, I can I can actually send it now to a doc. It will just take uh, a minute or so if okay. you allow. Fiber, okay. Uh, yes, no. Okay. Yes, no. Okay. Yes, no. Okay. I'll stop the share and then so. Please, please make sure to check your attendance via Telegram and also we will have a meeting after this week. <laughs> Okay, for the consultants, the protocol of Dr. Sebelino is now, oh, sorry, we deleted. I think we'll try again. For the resident, please double check when you are sending your protocols if it is attached to it. Thank you. Okay. Protocol is already up. Thank you, Dr. D. You may proceed. Okay. So, moving on to our review of systems, uh, the most notable uh, for at this time is is weight loss and the fatigue that he was experiencing and other parts of his review system was unremarkable. Moving on to our physical examination, uh, uh, I think I am in the chair, he was awake, alert, and not in his paper, not stress. His vital sign was still balancing for the increase. Uh, <laughs> Blood pressure, one foot no, over and then say that to be taken in that morning prior to going for concert. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. 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 Yes, so moving on to our mental status exam. Yeah, uh, he is appropriately black <laughs> wearing shorts and appropriately can't uh, hair with a far off gaze while waiting and no far how by the way. This behavior was very cooperative 
to the I found that but he was leaning forward from the chair and was slightly slouched. Uh, the patient was sitting calmly on his chair at that point. Very small and he was depressed with the very graphic. At this point, I was giving him the meeting answer with the geriatric depression scale and his poor level, which suggests depression and Hamilton depression and his scale, which is called which is moderate depression. This mere video is confirming that he did not even report of his pregnancy sleep and refused an appetite with a company loss, a company weight loss, as well as loss of his video. The speech at that point was with low volume. I was in fact with the issue of the speech volume. This might have been the beat number one. Uh, At this point, also, uh, I also gave him the monkey out of the assessment form, uh, assessment, assessment test. So, he scored 27, which is now. His memory is, his memory is unimpaired. Sometimes <laughs> 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 He uh, exhibited an unimpaired judgment and when asked for insight, he he would worse than the depression. First would be our again the demographics and personality. The the Muslim versus sixteen years of age. So he would know prior to that. Now there is a very strong, a very just allegedly a strong history of depression and anxiety on the mother's side of the family. This is a institution he does have an eye for the organization in order to improve the experience for the past 20 years of protection as much as he can. 
and has so lahat sa pinaalmin at hindi sa same grace has made it that way na nasa kanya ang loyalty ng mga tao ng Epikos na sa kanya mag-power to promote and promote to make regular the way once and really dedicates that, that so that he does not bother others so no one would dare to fight her the next would be Kaya parang it's easy to feel na parang ginatabangan ka because they will already try to impress Ma'am Grace at our expense. I cannot, wala, I don't care. It's the politics. It was glaring to the fact that and tell them that we will be getting that table. We will be getting that table that you continue decreasing of loss of interest as well as if someone started as early and become the king of the symptoms progress with his continued loss of concentration and loss of appetite with the second period or we will raise the concern that the 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 that that was given to him from the farm that he had to live. That he would have to live again with his family so that he could be watched over. Now, for his uncle's son, his son, his daughter, his daughter, his daughter, as well as his daughter, 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 and to but it's a bit too long, then now it's a long, so 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 it's a if after the hospitalization he has to live with his son and his wife, was he unable to go back to his farm or just visit his farm once in a while? Uh, at that point, we don't need to go back because, because of the restrictions for um, our being elderly as well as the older uh, 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 where is the farm located? Uh, sorry, uh, they are in the area, but the farm is also in the area, but they say it's uh, way higher up to the area. Okay, and then the residents of his son is located? In the center of the uh, So it's just uh, 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 an hour or less? travel from the house of his son to the farm. Is the assumption correct? Yes, please. yes please. Okay, so uh, because uh, before the hospitalization, before the alter altercation, he was able to cope well with the farm life, even yes, at his age. Yes, so is there a, a side... 
is there any other reason why he was restricted? Because it seems that he has been doing well in the farm. Was there a, a medical restriction? The when I did ask that doctor, it was just more of the hypertension too, because uh, <clears throat> because of me being one called pressure ng high side tension na kasi makarobaw and with the strongest case sa family niya the two parents died because of high tension he was in one for them even if he was relatively well so uh, from an active uh, uh, life living in the farm where he's able to walk freely and do some some, uh, some form of agricultural work he is now confined to the home of his his son, where he is now doing uh, a little of household chores and day to day uh, no, living activities. So, nag less ang kanyang physical activity. And he was confined at home na lang. Is that correct? Does the change in lifestyle? Okay, thank you. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you may continue to you. So, so for my differentials, so, this, is, this is my final thought when I was doing differentials. So, first, we will have. This, this is the is there an medical is it not the are there the good symptoms or the process as well as lastly not was there a common depression or disorder or their traits so for my first uh, differential diagnosis I first considered if there was some form of medical mm -hmm. disorder particularly vascular of a vascular type or vascular dementia because uh, we consider this due to the history of being elderly, uh, male, with no prior history of, uh, of <coughs> psychiatric history, with a gradual onset of symptoms. And yes, the consequences are not compliant. We know that the two most common or two most common dementias would be uh, dementia and childhood. Uh, Alzheimer's type, so Alzheimer's type would be the more common therapy, but to some degree, we have better powers, better function, and that's why the cells that would be one that's actually one that is being the same thing. But in terms of mental status, for example, so we have no psychotic symptoms, but there is depressed mood syndrome. Depressed mood would be very common with certain some cortical type of dementia, where in where the so there are affected, affected distortions as well as, as well as <coughs> uh, affected distortions as well as where uh, vascular dementia also belongs. But this entity, uh, this is entity was really due uh, to his history, again first, no history of stroke. Now the usual history that comes with vascular dementia is not only a single single episode stroke, multiple episodes stroke. So it would have either acute, uh, multiple acute or tantrum parts that would happen as well as there was no motor or neurological deficits during this exam, as well as uh, his function, his uh, functionality is good for the more part of 27, stable vitals, and not completely stable for 150 or 90 in blood pressure. But yeah, he said he said he scan, he scan as well as the other diagnostics were an unremarkable as of that time. The next uh, considered adjustment is further with, with his depressed mood. But with depressed mood. Yeah. Yeah, I those where, where the she wants to message history she of stressor on. comes in for Byron as what Dr. Tony asked that was the lifestyle the lifestyle I've 
how to trigger na lang. How to, no. Kasi ang ako nung uh, keyword, what are the triggers of the triggers of the triggers? I like it also that there is, first move, but the appropriate path that has to last. Triggers. How to trigger. How to trigger. But to deny the season of the that time. Although this would seem like a perfect fit, because as you can see, uh, that this is, that there are there's stressor and there's uh, marked distress and proportion as well as disturbance in his functioning. It was ruled out because most uh, because he was too fit for another for another condition and criterion C. As you can see, states that the stress related disturbance is not meet the criteria for another mental disorder. It's not many an exacerbation of interest in mm -hmm. mental disorder that she does not have. It. Before moving on to uh, one of the, uh, before moving on to the main diagnosis, uh, one ancilla and say uh, one diagnosis also that I considered was obsessive compulsive personality disorder. Now, we have to first and foremost to, to establish what it was for themselves and I knew that was continuously there and it affected his life which was very evidently to sorry 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 this should have to be the rule the rule the rule out category for for our obsessive compulsive personality disorder but I seem to have made two of the same for obsessive disorder I'll move it to the same features right so that you can see more. the factors as to why they considered just a compulsive personality disorder as you can see uh, he has been through all of through all of his life somebody who is uh well and has an eye for the liberation to a point that again for example is quite good for his religion uh very very rigid uh, performing tasks in protecting uh, strives hard for his family and to a point that he does seem to be work of all and the hold and uh, in upholding his principles in his work that he does enforce it so, and he does enforce it as you can see with his son and prefers to do things most of the time himself and has does have trouble with delegating due to his principle if you, if you want to done it properly you have to do it yourself and he is repeatedly shown to be very stubborn which also led to the point to the reason as to why as to why his consult was really even if he was aware that there were changes to himself already at this point. Now, uh, uh, other things that to be considered were will be the fact that uh, although not not uh, extra not overtly extracted at this point, but he did show that uh, he tends to take care of him in a way that he needs to be uh, saved for a rainy day uh, as so, uh, so observed when he did try to keep money for taking care of his child. And then moving forward, uh, I considered major depressive disorder now the main reasons why I would I have considered major depressive disorder is that I I was really in due to the following as you can see uh, so the numbers or the letters of numbers in following the symptoms would be uh, what criterion A and one would be what number and I'm sorry I should have uh, arranged it per symptom so that it would be clear when looking at it so as you can see major because of this one there should be a two week period presenting from dysfunctioning to at least one of the symptoms so it's very evident to my history that there was a pursuit and with loss of interest and pressure. along with the king came our uh feelings of worthlessness and guilt the loss of interest insomnia uh concentration loss of appetite the sluggishness or our retardation along with the suicide evolution now uh we also would like to 
distinguish this from the from the you know, the unipolar type or the bipolar type of depression. Now there were no reports of increasing coherence in the KDs as well as no elevated mood or no euphoria was persistently in a depressed mood. Now and, uh, and during our mental status exam, we pointed out that he still does have a depressed mood with an appropriate pattern. His speech appointed low volume and slow rate with disturbance in sleep, as well as denying suicidal ideations with his geriatric depression rate in scale of 11, again, suggesting depression and Hamilton uh, depression rate in scale, which is 19, which is moderate depression with never in diagnosis of major depressive disorder, FKT confined for NCM, and obsessive compulsive disorder, personality disorder, F60.5 for the ICD, as well as this point, hypertension stage 3, and control. At this point, I will be uh, stating my uh, advisor for social health and for the dynamic formulation. Uh, are there any questions? For So, prior to my management, I will be presenting the biosphere for social profile and the dynamic formulation. So, What was the reason why the wife did not live with the patient at the farm? Ah, yes, good. The his wife chose to live with his son to help out with the the son of the to, to what? I'm sorry, I did not hear it properly. To help out with the the son of especially that that he was already about have to actually that was his first their first grandchild for so his his mother wanted to be there to help him out. Uh, so because in your history the the patient decided to retire from work and do full time farming after after he inherited the farm from right? So that was even before the the son had married and is going to have a child so before then if, even before then the wife chose to live separately from the patient uh, they, they were uh, the the byron and the wife was initially living together but when when the time came that his son had was about to have the a child or near or they knew that this partner was pregnant, she decided or they made a decision that she will help out with his son. Okay, so the wife has just recently moved with the son. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, after uh, so he got married? So, uh, after the wife approximately got a year. Yes, approximately a year for me. And then before then, he was, she was living with the patient in the farm. Yes, <laughs> uh, okay. Because the, the, they had uh, a family home before uh, that, they, they inherited the farm, right? That's right. So the wife that was, was not living there? No, the, the family home for the was the real one for where his son was residing for. Why do you think I asked that? For the to and the how isolated the patient was for how the patient's isolation was. What else? Uh, for the because 
you were thinking of a personality disorder, right? Okay, so uh, if if there's a personality disorder, what do you think will be, be will be the quality of relationship they have, marital relationship they have? So uh, sometimes, uh, well, it would be a good thing to to really find out from the wife's perspective as yes, to the reason why she preferred to to live with a okay. son. Okay, so uh, I'm I'm going to give way to Dr. Kunana. She is raising her hand. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Are you done? Are you done, Agnes? I'm done now. Thank you. Oh, okay. Well, it is actually along the same line of your thinking. Because your objectives were to sort of elucidate how obsessive uh, compulsive personality disorder. Hi, so we should learn from this CP. Uh, fits okay, into good. this, uh, illustrate how, how, how it manifests in the pathology of this patient. But what I really also like to hear is what how, are the things that make in fact, OCD does his PD, if he has PD, um, contribute to the development of the pathology? That doesn't seem to clearly to me. I don't know if you are going to include that in your discussion. Uh, I, I mean, uh, what, what does the literature say or what have you read about? How does this type of personality disorder contribute to difficulty in marital relationships or difficulty in functioning and development of pathology when the situation changes because they tend to be ready? Just from, from your description, he seems to be pretty well functioning. Naman. So is it really a manifestation of PD or just an adjustment? Okay. That may uh, happen. And how that contributes to the difference. Let's so I think that's uh, what I would have wanted to see in your psychodynamics. Okay. Uh, 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 in terms of the literature of um, the OCD and in terms of the duration of depression, and, adjusting to certain situations because uh, OCTB, people with OCTB tend to be more rigid so they have a certain standard that they have they have to use or this is the plan that they have to do whenever there's whenever they that plan to do they have to do they would uh, have, have difficulty in uh, they have difficulty in uh, coming to terms with it and will because of that, an unattainable uh, expectation as of the moment, they, they would usually be blaming uh, themselves that they could not keep up with it and they would be disappointed. Uh, actually, uh, I may be able to answer the question for what is the situation for the man who would not. I would not. I'll explain the situation for the man who would not. So oh, my point along really is okay, like my thoughts I were really a lot of us are OC and OC versus PD traits. Does that make us more I mean what does the literature say? And how different is the person compared to maybe us? Why did he develop what in his dynamics, what in his predisposing or precipitating or perpetuating factors predispose to this? That's not too clear to me. So, hindi siya SPMC people, Ayan. 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 Ayan.
on site ba? So, pwede ka mag sa mga may in para makasama. Okay, I, I will just read for him what's the central conflict of your patient that's coming from Dr. Gonzalez. You will be presenting your biopsychosocial, right? Yes, uh, can you, 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 you haven't started yet, right? So can you no, just, no. okay. <clears throat> kindly, kindly insert the, the value that was instilled to him by his father. What do you think was the, the main value that was instilled on him by his father? Uh, he was trained to be what? He was trained to be hard working from the day job. Okay, so where will you put that in your biopsychosocial? Mm -hmm. Do you think it's a certain at strength that at this be... point in his life? Uh, at this point in his life, no. In his life. So I'll uh, the floor. Yeah. Continue. Thank you, Paul. Thank you, Paul. So, for 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 our patient, for the patient, again, he is a 62 year old no. male, currently experiencing uh, major depressive disorder. Now, for the for this, for the patient's biological aspect, you know, his genetics and uh, the genetics part of one uh, gives way to the vulnerability of his depression. Again, you know, he plays from an alleged strong family history where along with the age that he gives him the gives him the gives him the gives for uh, genetic products of foreign dysfunction uh, uh, the factors uh, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the biological alterations uh, uh, to the corresponding uh, uh, to stressful uh, to stressful uh, events which was stated in his life now his hypertension is also an additional risk factor so this has shown that the prevalence of depression in how they individuals with hypertension as high as others living in rural areas. Rural areas first we call the new kind of experiencing with cancerous events. And this then, because it's kind of people in the rural areas are mostly present with little education, though they can rarely have a job. Top 10 is a good treatment for high blood pressure, but this is not, it's not the case though for Byron, he was well educated. Uh, if he was well educated, and he did have proper uh, an adequate amount of, of finance, but due to his isolation as well as stubbornness, he mimics the core factors such as being undiagnosed with hypertension, and furthermore, leading to the risk factors that were pushed to him when he did, decided to be to delay in seeking his professional help, uh, along with the fact that. Uh, he presents with uh, just a compulsive personality as far as presenting, presenting with his traits of uh, being detailed, being proud of his rules, and show perfectionism, being devoted to his work and productivity, and relegating uh, and being able to relegate tasks, and show stringent and stubbornness. This was, this was brought about by his early upbringing, wherein his father would be strict on him, as well as expected him to to act a certain manner, which was performed well on his studies. He grew up internalizing this and saw his father's principle nice, as no person nice. and ended up making a role model of his father. Uh, this 
this was evident to you how his work ethic and even till the decisions that he made for how his family would be. Uh, he, he ended up uh, he ended up in life being hard working and hard working and diligent to a point that it means that he also would be rigid just to try, just to be able to move forward with what he has planned out. Um, this made it clear that Byron did need to follow plans and rigidly stick to the to his principles, even if he had to do that himself. Uh, in OCTD, the pressure may often co-occur because of a pervasive sense of not being good enough. Byron has a high expectation for himself as well as those close to him, as what we have seen with his son perform in certain standard. This standard is almost an impossible thing to participate resulting in feelings of low self-esteem and depression as experienced <laughs> by back time with the work of this being the loss of an object described as his initial plan in life and its dignity due to current changes in his life being implemented such as delegating tasks which he avoids most of the time as he wants to be sure that everything is done the way he wanted to. Thus, having to change his initial plans along the way, this made it harder to cope with his current situation. His age also places him between uh, the age of 40 to 65, which in the theory of uh, psychosocial stages of Arikari, so is the stage of generativity and stagnation, where it is evident that he is finding ways to contribute in his own way as a parent, where he is a teacher, where he can contribute to the next generation. Now, stop teaching because he wanted to pretend to the form, which produced the initial conflict for him as he want, as, as he was hesitant to leave his career. But once he was able to transition full time to full time form, he was able to regain his sense of control as well as being able to help out with teaching, music, and dance on the side. Everything was going to stop music and dance. Most recent removed from the farm, like which he has grown to love and care for back to his family. So this made him feel that he has donated, failing, you know, failing to find a way to contribute not to only to himself but to the community and to, the, to, to others, <coughs> thus making him more vulnerable before the pressure. Byron developed his and began to believe that he was responsible for the loss and feelings of extreme self is like rich and his thoughts and <laughs> seeing himself as the shell of what he used to be. And as a result, Byron feels no real value to himself and further lose self is to further his fall to the pressure. This was where some days in Shalak of insight to initiate console which led to the And it's all this Byron eventually find this reason for it and get back to his usual activities, which is place this way to fight to the service and pushing towards recovery. The thus being the hard work and intelligent aspect of him uh, I believe would be the, the a double edge so it drove him to drove him to doing for his treatment would also help him for help him drive him to recovery during the time. Now socially in the farm, which is in the first place, to help him. Uh, also, due to COVID 19 restriction, it also is hard for his family to relax. Even though they want to all the impossible support and many friends as well as the loving family, they did not push him to seek counsel to have conviction at the very day. Which led him to reach the current situation as well as having a little knowledge about the things. Thankfully, Byron found the reason to find this console when his grandchild was born or was about to be born and then was eventually born. He wanted to be part of his grandchild's life and couple with the fear of his person and symptoms, finally made him see console and as well as the which was located relatively near to his current home. 
Combined level of education, I can also need it easier to explain the concept. Yes, or yes, because he's given the relative ease. Relative ease to that to him. Please, Are you done, Dave? Yes, please. Um, uh, why are there blank spaces under relationships? We don't we don't see any predisposing factors. Why are there for relationships and precipitating factors? Retrospectively, to look at normally, I am starting to sorry. Traffic. Sorry. I am sorry, but the part of the person my entry is going. May we request everyone to turn off their videos? Let's try if it will improve the connection. Thank you. I'll also turn off their video. Thank you, Dave. Okay, Dave, can you can you say it again? Ah, yes, please. Uh, in in retrospect, there there are also predisposing factors in this relationships to what we see as we were looking at him. So, I, I was looking at him as a case. Uh, also, the, the relationships with other people as well as even what we mentioned earlier of the possible uh, risk factor in his relationship with uh, which was not have been that for the of this case leading to the fact that he was uh, just left in the parliament to be living in the uh, From what I gathered from your history, he, he has been very happy with the farm, right? Uh -huh. Okay, so, well, so where is that? Is that a uh, part? For this that, that at this point, of the, uh, this happens with the farm uh, would help him uh, is a protective factor in the environmental aspect. But anyway, you look at you look at the past history, you mean the past few years of tea. He was very happy teaching. Uh -huh. He he was uh, his students were very appreciative of his work. And in fact, after he retired, his students still come to him. Right? Yes, ma'am. And then when he lived in the farm, he felt accomplished. There was a sense of fulfillment, from what I assume from your from your history. But when he was pulled out of the farm and uh, has to stay confined in the house of his son, or actually their home in Turil, then that started it, right? The, out, the altercation with the neighbor because he tried to control the speed limit of vehicles uh, passing by his property. What do you think that was an added stressor? Uh, or was he not he, he was not affected by that? He was more affected by the fact that he was confined at home. Displacement. Yeah. 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 So as to not continue monitoring his health, not only psych-wise, but also medical-wise, because I'm going to spend more bit of attention, and also to build his incitement to psycho-educate him. In the long term, we are expecting to prevent 
So it's very good plan for us because we have already stops and uh, to maintain its functionality as well as to ensure the continued social support of the family to educate them also for what to is their case going through. Now, for the diagnostics, I requested the our usual diagnostics, which is uh, CDC, chest X ray, PA, ECG, uh, other uh, the electrolytes, SGP, SGOP, FDSSK. Most is to check his medical status as well as to consider for reasons, as well as because our medi the medications that we have to give will also inevitably affect. If we do not, if we do not, uh, if we do not pull up the process, although uh, the although we had uh, a repeat, uh, I, although we had a CT scan, uh, I also ordered a repeat CT scan to check if there are advanced changes in the in the. Result, but also, I also told him that it could be the use of priorities due to financial issues, and as well as there was some uh, indication of the moment for in terms of our neurological tests. And there was no so, our results and results were, were mostly normal. Uh, as you can see, the potassium is slightly low at the point. Other than that, his liquid profile just showed an increase in triglycerides with PPC, as well as PPC one and the other complete blood count. So at the first, at our the first concert, it was very dangerous because first and foremost, uh, at this other side, we can not only the patient, but also the family. And also, uh, did the safety plan in him to contact and what he, what he needs to do when he just have the suicidal radiation again, because he does have the history of radiation, so we must put the patients first. Uh, 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 sorry, we are currently experiencing some problems in our internet due to the flooding in the city. Uh, 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 or more, was better for the patient's profile being elderly, and would probably with, with the risk of the risk of <laughs> other comorbidities, such as actually signing out, the hypertension, as well as other possible kidney uh, problems. And I said, Telegram, please, well, with those. The most technical thing with no with the standard of the next is due to his difficulty in sleeping. I started him with Kitayakin. A low dose of our Kitayakin and Kitayakin is another atypical and very safe topic, but in this dose is 25 minutes. It will only give us a it will give us only sedation. Uh, the other choice at this point in time would have been uh, benzodiazepines, but the issues in benzodiazepines in elderly has been well highlighted and uh, has been well highlighted and uh, thus I chose to tie up and thus I chose to tie up in, which has better, better profile for our patient. Now, I also strongly advise him to consult regarding his hypertension, which he did so for our next consult, where it became, where it became, uh, at this point he was still calm and cooperative, he was a legitimate, he found him to get his hands. He reported that his sleep 
was very good to a point that he was overly sedated. And thus, they up to cut it in half. And he was And he wakes up. Well, that's So, at this time, we tried to remove them in the patients, but he found it. He found that it made it difficult for him to sleep again. So, he continued with it. He reported that his appetite was returning. And he was able to eat snacks at least once a day. Trying to ask for snacks once a day. And he was able to focus slowly on his music and dancing. Uh, speech at this time was more continuous with better volume and great to ask him to increase his voice. He still did not report of any perceptive disturbances with no violent outbursts or suicide violations are reported with good, continued good support from his family and friends with no other subjective complaints or his medication. To update on his uh, hypertensiveness, he did see one sort of their local, local health center, which started him on antihypertensive <laughs> As, as well as the monitor, as well as monitor on his own every morning. And, he did, and thus he was in the time back at home and reported to the luggage. Now, he, he helped himself further by combining what he was initially doing before, which was the medication and therapy. He was also reported he was also able to do a little bit of walking around the house and started to socialize again with his family and friends as well as increasing his faith in a higher power. At this point he still had interrogation to a better insight and his vitals his vitals were stable to the blood pressure to 50 at that point in time. And again, I did a repeat, repeat uh, Montreal quality assessment, which yielded 28. A uh, depression rating scale with the material, which is fine, but still suggesting depression can be of 17, which is still depression. <clears throat> and I decided to continue to the medication of the day of acetalopram at the same dose as the same dose due to the number to the uh, the improvement that was seen as well as the concept in treating how other you were in the child to treat at the most uh, the minimum uh, uh, dose which is most effective for patients so so, so there was an increase for the one now I did go with the increase uh, uh, in the one half of the period of time <laughs> and to continue his hypertension, and at this point, uh, some supporters said that there was a which was aimed to, to, which was aimed to improve the maladaptive, his maladaptive, some of his maladaptive behaviors, which is whenever he did not, uh, he could not do a certain thing, he would feel bad that he was not able to do it. So we had to, we had to refrain okay. that and made him uh, made him do another thing for example uh, at this time he cannot go to the farm he cannot do this so we tried to refrain that thought of being able to help more at home being able to to help out, especially when the, the child is going to be born so again further psychoeducation will but it was still the same thing again. I asked for the mother, but it was uh, difficult to bring two elderly. Huh? It, was, it would be difficult for the son to bring both no. of his elderly parents at once because they only had a motorcycle. For our three parts, uh, most of most of the most of the most of the results are are normal. And then, but at this time, uh, for sleep and appetite. Uh, his yeah, his mood is still uh, is improving. So Stephen Africa is not but thankfully the contents of the mean he now is playing the guitar and singing once again and enjoying reading literature as well as with the resort in full writing poetry that he did before. 
his well, his speech for the improvement the volume rate still the numbers of the students says no outbursts of violence or any reports as we said in the previous time he still came in uh, the building is still came in to the health center position to, to do so because of the continued, continued increase or continued elevation of his blood pressure he, he said that his medications were added which is the loss of the loss of prescribed now just the function was noted and being able to perform his video sufficiently and able to tend to his grandchild because his grandchild was already born and being continued to yoga meditation with some cardio exercises and the rest with an impairment now again the diagnosis were done was already accepted due to scheduling problems and for the symptoms and analysis we expressed the want to return to the farm so we did uh i did try to open up the topic with us but they weren't able to uh, they needed to talk about it as they can so they would, they would also bring the mother there or or they would call the mother, but at that time he, no. she did not have a phone, so they decided to talk about that they would talk about most of the stuff. So, first, they would talk about the same value, which is the ethics of the GDS radio which is significant for the world, and they would talk about the same thing. They would talk about the same thing, which is 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 the same thing. Uh, such as uh, such that I still can, such that I did not I decided not to increase the, the depression as he was as our patient was experiencing uh, improvement and then continue uh, attacking for sleep at this point uh, uh, to, to include the, uh, the patient feedback so that he does feel uh, better and more uh, smoothly that he will try to that he will try to uh, see if he can wean off the developing so so I did not need to that but did not the told him that if it was impossible that we would still continue until our next consult. Uh, so, so part of the secretary was then I took two minutes there and reminded to put in my pretension which leads me to my uh, continued working diagnosis of major depressive disorder and such a consultative personality disorder and hypertension stage 2. Dave, at this point, okay. can you summarize for us your discussion? Yes, no, I'll summarize it. I'll just go to the slide and the number of the financial summaries. The balance will just stay. The balance will just stay. The balance will just stay. So a reminder for the residents, keep your slides to 50 slides for your history and PE and uh, course in the wards. So that we can also focus on your discussion. Yes. So, so, uh, so my discussion was, uh, is, always, is always about the effect of uh, so I was just sure that that gave me a task on the COVID and and especially in the psychological side. So in, in summary, the social isolation, the social disconnection uh, that is caused by the serious public health concern and all the adults is, uh, is very, very, very bad uh, due to the psychosocial issues and uh, other social mental health problems such as the mental health problems. Every vascular will also be increased due to the pandemic, and thus, because of that, um, there is a definite need for action, both in short and long term, to minimize the negative effect 
of the pandemic, and uh, one of it is to increase the access to technology and implement digital literacy programs in our elderly population, uh, especially going forward into an increasingly digital future. Now, our well, actions will not be able to complete the year that elderly from the negative effects of the pandemic. Uh, may it be physical, which is what we're doing in the psychological due to our isolation and uh, the uh, isolation and the that leads to depression. Oh my god, that looks so scary! And I'm sure that going forward, this is so traumatic. The attention and resources it needs. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my so for this for this case, uh, what were your learnings or looking back, how will you um, help this patient more since he will still follow up right now? How was it, Maiba? Okay. It looks scary. You have to drink that. Uh, one of my, one of my oh my God, can I close my eyes when uh, I drink that one? The, it's for jobs. First and foremost, the, from the clarifying questions that the... Uh, the consultant has asked for it, especially in the relationship aspect, because that could also affect uh, the support, as well as uh, in how to try to be a member as to if there are other central factors that could have been uh, to the issues now, because that could be the one for the issue to be taken care of so that he can be. He can, Experience that the that the as well as looking moving forward for the continuing the case of the other one. Or people in the car residents of PGA. Any other clarifications from the consultant? Yes, doctor. Her ballet. Question. First comment is probably uh, as a reminder for the other residents who will present the case. When you when you do case discussion, please relate it to the case. And, uh, make sure that your discussion will be based on your plans and reasons for the plans or, or what are the things that you need to address goals in therapy so these are the discussions that I suggest you, you need to include but uh, not in general terms but specifically for this region. so my question is uh, if you are done with pharmacotherapy, you, the patient was given uh, escitalopram and uh, have you Have you checked literature on ketayapine given in elderly population? Uh, yes, yeah. Actually, the key. I have more found that the lower doses it had it be didn't need any it posed less risk for the stress. So I think that in general, that increased mortality and morbidity in the age in the elderly. Okay, so what organ are we thinking of that we want to do if we have been given in the elderly population? Probably a little of liver. Kitaya pinayas is uh, actually mabait sa liver, but you need to monitor the, the kidney functioning. But uh, at your dose, probably we are safe. Next, after pharmacotherapy, what other management do you want to do with this patient? Uh, for this patient, I, I, I'm reading on the uh, on 
the different, the very what's it called, therapy between the what do you mean? What they were trying to use for soya or almond? Ah, uh, so you can use it for the very long therapy. Render to your patient. What? Um, so that would be good for you. I'm just better for when, when those traffic come from. Okay, so he had an adjustment problem initially, which later on. What? Triggered the difference. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. Plus the character traits, the personality. I know that meeting. So given those kinds of, and then he, well, he's losing uh, at his age. He is starting to lose the supervision after the OPD meeting. Value and then considering his age too. Uh, okay. Okay. So there are some things that you. Other than E and U, are there two and choose the best one? You underwent supervision for this case, uh, Dave, no? Dr. Dave? Yeah, that's for us. Okay. So, you continue to undergo supervision because uh, you know, at this point, the patient is uh, on OPD basis, na, di ba? So, uh, yes, sir. Oh, in, so, in, we can... In my first part, no. Uh, in my first part, uh, I should not uh, ask for supervision to uh, even the course that will tell about uh, the patient's treatment and not just for the patient's Okay, so um, other, you know, that's that's good that you will undergo supervision from here on forward. But reminder to the residents, no, not just for the case presentation that you should undergo supervision, but for for the management of difficult cases, so that at least uh, you can already um, you can already help the patient. And not, you know, have to change your management plans in the middle of already third or fourth council. Okay. But uh, thank you, Doctor D, for your presentation. Uh, do we have other questions for clarification? If there are no there are more, no more uh, thank you everyone to the console. Please be so reminded to uh, fill up his uh, evaluation, Dr. Dave's evaluation. Um, at this point, uh, may we ask everyone to turn on their video for the presentation. Who will be taking the, bit, the screenshot? Okay. Raj, okay. You can turn on video. Raj, okay na ba? For a while, the music is ready. Na po. Okay, 
Okay. Okay. Thank you for. Thank you for the first question. Thank you. 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 Thank you.